Hey guys, welcome back. We finally have another review today. I'm sorry they haven't been much lately. Arizona is not exactly the first to get these new sets, so I have to resort to ordering them online. But if you do live in Arizona and know where to find these handy dandy new sets, just let me know. And before I start this video, for all you first contact goers out there who are going ecstatic over it, um, I still need some more voice actors, and uh, I have my script and everything here. But it's really hard to voice tons of different people. So, you know, there's still Spartans and there's still Marines that are available and ODSTs. So, all the help would be appreciated. I need all these voice actors to be able to release it on time this month, the end of this month. Um, end of this month, early next month. But I'm really shooting for the end of this month for the first episode. But I can't release it unless we get all the voice actors. So, if you are willing to do it, just send me a message. But, anyways, on to the set. This is the Megavox Halo UNSC Cryobit. Interestingly, it is the first set that actually has a licensed confirmed like character in the Halo series. So this is actually Master Chief and they have it. But first your manual is just a simple like fold out manual, nothing really special about that. But the box. Very small, very small box. It's very cool. You have all your information here. All the stuff. You got Master Chief going on there and you got the cool animations for it. You know, the other cool new sets, and uh, the animations of what this set can do, which is really cool. Then right here, it says UNSC Cryobay. Awakening from the Cryobay aboard his space vessel, the Master Chief prepares to receive mission orders from his AI Cortana. With ready access to an assault rifle, battle rifle, and sticky detonator from the weapons rack, he is prepared to fight enemies of the UNSC in any combat scenario. And this is what I mean by it's actually licensed. They actually say... It is the Master Chief, not just like a Spartan and Cortana. So that's really cool. Maybe they got those issues out of the way, like the whole debate if the kit, the figure that looked like Cat was Cat, and the one that looked like George was George, and the one that looked like Noble Six was Noble Six. Finally getting that stuff out of the way, which is very, very nice, because this stuff is quite annoying, to be honest. But you get, well, technically two, I guess, but one Cortana, I don't know if she's really a minifigure. But you get Master Chief, which is really, really cool. He is like the other Spartans that you get, just his, he is a darker green. The camera will focus. Focus, there you go. As you can see, Master Chief is a darker green than the other ones. Which really stands him out, because you know his, his armor is a lot darker. It's not like a really light green. It's kind of a darker green. He doesn't have his like a little scratch on his chest though. That's the only thing that's missing, but not really that big of a deal. But once again, the detailing on these minifigures is insane. Even the little like the padding, like the suit he wears under his armor, even like the stuff on his spine like, that you see in the game looks crazy. And all this other detailing, even the stuff on the visor. Mega Box always outdoes himself on these. I just love the detailing. It's pretty awesome. So you get Master Chief and the. I guess technical next minifigure is Cortana. Not really much detailing, it's just kind of a mold. So you don't really get much detailing. And for those of you who wonder if it lights up like the uh, Forward Unto Dawn set, no it doesn't. Forward Unto Dawn is the only one where it actually lights up. I'm still in the process of trying to get that. Uh, I'm not sure when I'm going to get it, just because, you know, it's $250. It's quite a lot of money, but I'll figure it out. Maybe I'll do a fundraising thing or something, I don't know. Give me suggestions. But, onto the set itself. Cortana's not, not, not actually glowing, that's the sunlight. Um, these pieces right here, this one like the radar, with the covenant sighting and stuff, and the Master Chief's like cryo thing, these are actually all printed. They're not stickers. There are no stickers in the set at all. These are both actually just printed. Then right here you get a weapons rack with three weapons. First you get a Assault rifle, nothing special about it, just black assault rifle. Next you get a sticky detonator. Once again, it's black, no really crazy detailing about it. And last, get it out, you get a battle rifle. Once again, just black, no insane detailing. Now for the cryopod, which is really cool. It's, it, it, it's assembled in pieces. Like an ODST pod, there's two pieces, you put the pegs in and click these together. This thing right here clicks on and then you put the glass in. 
Now what's really cool is that this thing actually moves up and down just so it can rest on this bar right here so it can lean or also just fall back. Um, it says one six right here. I don't from heart know if that's the cryo pod Master Chief sent at the beginning. I would assume so because it's you know the cryo bay. So let's just assume that. And uh, this again is not a sticker detailing all detailing so no stickers. This just flips open like that. Now unlike the other sets where there's pegs that go in here, there is not actually a peg. He just kind of goes right in and sits there, really because it's kind of standing up, you're not going to need a peg. Then it closes, and you have Master Chief in his cryopod. Oop, whoops. And that's really cool. Now, this is really mostly kind of like a cool display piece. As for playability, it's... I wouldn't... There's not really much playability with it, other than like taking him out of the cryopod and reenacting the opening of Halo 4. But you can use it for some cool stop motions and everything. But it's mostly one of those cool kind of check it out, Halo 4 kind of sets. Um, but it is really cool. It'll cost you $20 depending where you live. I got it for $20 off Amazon. I've had to resort to ordering most of these new sets online, but whatever, no problem. It is really cool though. It is a $20 well spent. It's a really interesting, cool little set. You know, you got Master Chief and his cryo bay. It's the only actual set where they say it's Master Chief, which is really awesome because all the other ones are just like, oh, it's it's a Spartan that looks pretty much exactly like Master Chief, but it isn't Master Chief. And that got really irritating. But, all in all, it is a great set, a great buy, one of those cool little knick-knack sets. If you have $20 lying around, I would recommend you buy this set. It's very awesome. You get Master Chief, Cortana, Cryobay, some cool weapons to add to your weapons collection. And it's pretty awesome. So, all in all, awesome set. There will be more sets coming soon. If there is a particular set you want, like uh, the Mantis or the Colden Clash or anything, any particular set you want, leave a comment and I will add it to my list and prioritize them. But anyways guys, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you.